Hi, Christian Chase here with Chase Real Estate. I'd like to take you through our brand new kitchen, cabinet, countertop, refrigerator package. And this is what we use in all of our properties now. We're getting a phenomenal response from buyers and the buyer's agents. And this would be the case where we do have to replace the kitchen cabinets. So what we're doing is we're doing new white kitchen cabinets, a shaker style. We're using Carrera marble countertops, stainless steel appliances. And um, I'm gonna take you through some of the items here that we do. First thing that we're doing that's new is the Carrera marble countertops. These countertops are absolutely show perfect in our properties. They're light, they're bright. Um, buyers and the agents are commenting that how much they like this particular countertop. It's a little bit more than granite, but it is something that we're using in all of our properties now. The next thing that we're using is we're doing a uh, shaker style kitchen cabinet. The key thing to the shaker style cabinets is we're staggering the cabinets and as we stagger the cabinets, it's adding a little extra dimension and we're putting a crown molding on these kitchen cabinets as well. So something that you wanna uh, definitely incorporate into the rehab. Then as we come over here into our uh, sink area, the sink, we're doing a undermount sink and faucet, stainless steel. It looks great, very inexpensive. It's actually included in the cost of the, um, the countertop cost. So uh, that's something that we're doing in all of our properties. Then as we take a look at some of our appliances, the one thing that most investors miss when they're rehabbing a property is they'll just buy any uh, refrigerator. And a lot of the properties that we sell, we're standing in a rather small kitchen. I'm arm to arm, and I can stand in this kitchen and reach both countertops. Um, because of that, we want to make sure that we have a counter depth refrigerator. When you come over here, you'll see that the counter depth refrigerator, only the door sticks out from the refrigerator itself. And what that does is that adds a lot of extra square footage within the kitchen and uh, it really opens it up. And uh, if you put in a regular standard type refrigerator inside the property, the problem is it would probably be sticking out to about right here. And then this kitchen gets smooshed down and it's much too small. One of the last items that we do inside these properties is we're doing a vinyl tile that's groutable. And these floors that we're using in here, this stuff is incredible. It's very inexpensive. It's vinyl, but we grout it with a gray color grout. And it goes so well with the carpet that we use, with the cabinets that we use. Uh, it's an uh, uh, inexpensive product that does feel like you would really have to get down on your hands to touch this tile to know that it's actually vinyl it really looks and feels more like a porcelain type tile. And with it being grouted, that absolutely makes it look even more like a, a real tile, a porcelain type tile. So this is our rehab project. This is exactly what we're doing in our kitchens right now. And I would encourage you to be doing this on every one of your properties. Um, you can always check out our website, chaseforeclosure.com because we have all the materials that we're using currently. And, um, uh, these are the, our rehab teams that we're working with. They're buying all of these materials in bulk right now. So the cost is coming down on each one of these items and ultimately saving us money as investors when we're rehabbing our houses. As always, if you have any questions, you give us a call at 630-527-0095 and check out our website, chaseforeclosure.com. Thanks.